The protest is coming to an end for a Kingston artist. Pat Shea is getting ready to officially unveil his fourth and final piece in a series of paintings, featuring U.S. President Donald Trump, entitled, The Pilgrimage to Insanity, Shea says it's part of the conversation about extreme solutions to the problem of out-of-control leaders. Read more, Kingston artist completes third Donald Trump protest piece The composition borrowed from Bob Jackson's photo of Jack Ruby and Lee Harvey Oswald shows the president being tased by a figure gripping a newspaper, with the words free speech, truth and justice seen. For Shea, the meaning of his final protest piece is simple, this painting is more about how lucky we are to have free speech and be able to express ourselves when we see things we don't agree with so this painting speaks to that. Shea said, Watch, Kingston artist depicts Trump in latest piece of political commentary Shea's first Trump-inspired painting was the coronation of Donald Trump, number two, the impeachment of Donald Trump, fake news, Saint Donaldo, was his third, the pilgrimage to insanity, is his last, and Shea says the four protest paintings give him something tangible with which to remember this particular presidency, I wanted a permanent record of what this president has done, and it's something that we can look and remind ourselves every day the road we can go down if we are not careful, the artist said. Read more, the Santi Fox blasts, crazy, ignorant, Donald Trump who, lies all day, Shea says the painting will go on display later this week at Frameworks on Princess Street. Copyright 2018 Global News, a division of Chorus Entertainment Inc.